everyone, and this week's toy hunt is filmed at Target. I'm in the Pokemon section, and it's pretty empty. <laughs> I was, one day I'll find some Evolving Skies. They do have this interesting little, oh, trivia, trivia game. That's kind of cute. I like the bright colors in your little Pokemon starter characters. And then how to train your dragon has some of those little mystery eggs that you can hatch. There's a lot of Zero Smashers. We have some Sonic. Oh, those are cool. Those are anniversary figures. Look how cute Sonic looks there. It's actually really awesome. <laughs> oh, and then wacky packages. I didn't know they made like a, a big container of them. Oh, Super Mario. <laughs> Love it. That's so cool. Comica? Comic? I don't know how to pronounce his name right. But he's really neat, and I have the plushie. <laughs> I have the plushie version. Never seen the action figure though. And then more Super Mario stuff. They have that fun set. Love it. Glad glad there's some new stuff coming out. And then of course that moves down to Roblox. There's a ton of those big sets. We have the Fortnite Target holiday series. I like the Christmas tree art, and then just a bunch of other Fortnite stuff. Looks like there's a lot of vehicles too. And then on the flip side to this aisle, we have Transformers. Okay, we have one couple new things. There's Thrust, but there's also Snapdragon here. Um, oh, which is cool. He's one of the triple changers. Look at the dragon form. That's nice. I like the cool purple colors. And he's a, a Decepticon. And then they still have a lot of the Bumblebee figures a lone rc which i love that figure so much but other than that nothing nothing too new with transformers there's a random gi joe there some of the marvel stuff oh look at they have little groot as the the little floral colossus that's cute and then some of those classic marvel figures <laughs> which is cool you gotta love the iron man one and then on the next aisle, we have like the Jurassic World figures, Toy Story, ooh, and then the Monsters at Work, which isn't that a new thing on Disney Plus, but they have some figures I haven't seen before. They have the figures in a set, and then you can buy them individually. They have some Coco stuff, and um, the Disney Mariverse. Oh, these are so cool. Oh, cool. We've never seen Buzz Lightyear yet. So he's one of the deluxe figures like Captain um, Jack Sparrow. So that's kind of cool. And wow, they just so cool and detailed. And of course, Belle's amazing. And then it looks like they have the Mickey Sorcerer, which is also really neat. They did a great job. I haven't purchased any yet, but if I did, I think it would be Belle. Oh, look, Space Jam and his head's on. LeBron James's head's on. That's, that's nice. TikTok hasn't gotten to him yet, which is rather silly. Um, it looks like Star Wars has some cool diecast figures. That chicken walker is awesome looking. As well as the IG-11 with Baby Yoda. Aww. That's cute. <laughs> Baby Yoda gets carried around a lot. And then some wrestling figures. They have some some new ones. Or at least ones I haven't seen at my, my previous targets. I do like to mix up the locations I go to as well. This Target also has sort of the, the anime figure section. We have some One Piece from the Anime Heroes line, which are the deluxe figures, and then some cool stuff. Mortal Kombat. Um, is that Spawn? That's cool. Oh, and a Disney animator collection? These are really neat. So I guess with the Disney stores closing, Target is going to pick up some, some Disney products. So that's kind of cool. I love those Disney animator dolls. They're so cute. And then this Target also has kind of like the random blind bag aisle um, down at the toy section versus in front. So this is where they have a lot of the slap bands, the blind bags, a lot of bullseye toy stuff um, in this section. So that's kind of cool, including cutie beans. Oh, there's the, they have some of the Fiesta foodies, which are adorable. So cute. Nice to see some. And then some random stuff. This this is where it gets messy. We have some like toy mini brands in here and then some other other items. Oh, that's a cute Toy Story set. <laughs> and 
And then in the front section, they have their advent calendars. And here's the Pokemon one for this year. Oh my goodness, it's big. It is a big one. Oh, Vaporeon. How cute. Bulbasaur has a Santa hat. So it looks like you get two inch figures and three inch figures. So I wonder if they're the the same ones you would find in the Wicked Cool Toys and some of them have Santa hats <laughs> and then some don't. Oh, that's so cute. That's awesome. They have the Barbie one. They have some neat Jurassic World. Look at that dinosaur on the boat. That's actually really cool. <laughs> and then they have the Friends. They have the Mandalorian, Holiday Advent Calendar, the Avengers one, which looks fun. What's Spider-Man doing there? Um, and then Harry Potter. We saw that one. And then also the Lego City. Love Advent Calendars. And then on a little end cap here too, they have, or side cap, they have some of the Lego minifigures for Looney Tunes. I think it's the Looney Tunes uh, anniversary ones. Look how cute. I love Roadrunner and Wile E. Coyote. <laughs> They're my faves. <laughs> and then moving on to this um, section. Here's the little sorting hat. Love it. Um, and they have the electronic pets and some really cool looking Harry Potter figures. I don't know if I've seen Dumbledore up close. Very cool. They also have this big VTech Unicorn Pegasus. Wow. Has really cool light up wings. It's huge too. So that one's really nice. And then they have the Pikachu Panda. We've seen him before. And some of the other sparkling VTechs, as well as the present pets. There's the Rainbow Corn Fairies which are cute. Love the wings in back. <laughs> Some little live pets. Random Care Bear in this section. The purses. Ooh, look at the Tamagotchi, the Pac-Man one, but it comes with a Pac-Man figure. That's cool. I've never seen that, that double pack. So cute. And then the My Squishy Little Dumplings. This Target has their plushie section here too. Oh, that's a cute rainbow narwhal. But alas, no um, no Squishmallows. And then on the flip side, we have the Rainbow High dolls. Cool stuff. They have a lot of the Winter Break dolls, but no, none of the new dolls yet. Haven't found those yet. They have a random Jade for the 20th, or 20th anniversary of Bratz. They also have the Nana Na Surprise Slumber Party ones, which are so cute. They do such a great job on the theming of Nana Na Surprise. Love the animals. And then My Little Pony has the new generation. Oh, these are like the little teeny tiny figures. Oh, that's kind of cute. But you also have the, the main six. So I guess maybe it is a compilation set. Oh, and then Target has some new dolls as well. They're called Fresh, or maybe it's the Fresh series. That's cool. They have some really neat outfits, and I think they have some separate um, outfit packs down there for, for your dolls. And then there's a Polly Pocket set, this Butterfly Nature set. That's kind of cool looking. Some Jojo Siwa up there. And here's that My Little Pony set again. In the Disney section, they have this really cool set of princesses. They have kind of glittery outfits. And then some of the new Disney style series dolls. They have Cinderella and Belle. That's cool. Belle's outfit swirls into a rose. Um, it looks like just these two. But that's kind of a fun series. I'm always curious what, what their looks are going to be. Then they have the series six uh, princess comics. And then some of those dress ones and those sets, as well as like a glitter dress version. Oh, and they have changeable outfits. And then on the end cap here, they have more of the um, Illy Forever Disney dolls. And I've never seen the Tinkerbell inspired one. She is absolutely gorgeous. I love it. They did such a good job on the face sculpting on these. 
I think this is the Ariel inspired one and then the Frozen inspired one. We saw this one a couple weeks ago with the Olaf hat. Love her outfit. Um, beautiful, beautiful dolls. I haven't purchased any yet, but wow, it's, it's cool to see them in person. And oh my goodness, look at this Frozen set with a little Olaf like plushy something I don't know it looks adorable and then they have the Minnie Mouse ones such fun accessories and such a variety to to choose and mix and match from your dolls and these looks like they would you know fit your um, our generation dolls and, and American girl size dolls as well what fun accessory packs I really love this frozen one very cute design and gorgeous dolls. Good job. <laughs> and then down the LOL surprise aisle, I'll just kind of pan over. There's so many OMG items um, and sets. And then they also have these ones with the little mini doll, which I really like. Some of the tweens, <laughs> some of the surprises. A couple of the LOL boys, not too many. And then that segues into cute Tito's. Ooh, these are little taste buditos. Oh, that's cute. It's like a little heart. Two wraps become one. Oh, that's adorable. I love cute Tito's. I think they're doing a good job with all their theming stuff. They have some Carnival Itos, some of the Shimmer Babies. Um, I like how Hatchimals are now in this section at Target. And let's see some mini brands just the collector cases there and then oh yeah they do have a full case of the series three couple couple of those going on as well as the shopping mart and then oh yeah the toy shop so here's the toy shop and it comes with that gold spongebob but a, four other minis as well so that's really cute i bet that's going to be really popular for for the holidays they also have more of the disney adorables um, I realize only in the houses can you find the Alice in Wonderland figures, so I'm so tempted. So tempted. <laughs> and then, oh wow, I haven't seen the um, Secret Crush Series 2 dolls in a while, the ones with the blue hammer, so that's kind of cool. And then, of course, we have the Lala Loopsie dolls. Ah, oh, here's Candy Stripes, or Candy, is it Candy Ribbons, I think? Um, and then Jewel Sparkles with Cat. <laughs> Oh, they are so, so cute. I wish I had more room for some of these big dolls. Candle Slice of Cake with her little sister. Oh, and here's Comet Starlight, Dot's little sister. I don't see her often. She's so cute with the little worm. Um, that's adorable. And then Cloudy Sky. Oh, she looks so pretty. And then her little sister is actually sitting right next to her, which makes such a cute set. I love the blue button eyes. <laughs> so adorable. So I think the only large doll I haven't seen is um, Pixie, Pixie Flutters. I wonder if she's in a different wave assortment, but love them. Hope they make more for their 10th anniversary. They also have some of the Kindy Kids dolls. And then we have some of the Bluey figures, which I'll end it here on this toy hunt. I'm not gonna purchase anything this time, but I do hope you enjoyed the toy hunt. If you did, feel free to give it a thumbs up. And I want to thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. And I hope to see you next time. Until then, take care.